Welcome. In this series of videos, we're going to show you how Log10 Pro supports you through your whole aviation career. As a student, Log10 Pro is free for your first 250 hours of log flight time. Adding flights to your logbook in Log10 Pro is quick and easy. You can log everything about a flight from people to aircraft and endorsements to pictures. Once you've added a flight, you can share it with your instructor to get their remarks and a digital signature. Let's start by setting our typical role to student. Tap More, Settings, My Logbook, Typical Role, and choose Student. Of course, Log10 Pro is designed to let you get straight into your logbook and enter flights on the fly. Just head to the Logbook tab, tap the plus button in the top right, and enter the details for the flight. Directly from here, you can add the aircraft, and they will be saved for easy access the next time you're flying in that aircraft. You can also enter your aircraft, people, and places in advance if you'd like to or add extra details you missed when you originally logged the flight. For example, let's add an aircraft we're going to be flying in next. Just tap More, then choose Aircraft, and tap the plus button on the top right. If you're unsure of the details of an aircraft type, we suggest starting with that field. Tap Type, drag down to reveal the search field, tap in the search field, and then tap All Types. If we type Cessna in the search field, we'll get a list of all Cessna aircraft to choose from. If we type C-172, that specific aircraft comes up and we can choose it. We can then set the aircraft ID and any other details we want to. To see a full list of the fields available to you, tap the Action button in the top right, then Configure Fields, then Configure Section, and add the fields you need. You can even add your own custom fields. Going back to the aircraft, this is one we fly often, so we'll set it as a favorite. That way it'll appear in blue at the top of the list for easy access as our list of aircraft grows. And if we have a regular instructor, we can make them a favorite too. Go back and tap on People. Tap the plus button to add a new person. Fill in the details for the instructor, set them as a favorite, and then we'll add an image by tapping on the image area and choosing an image from our photos. Let's also set our home airport up. Go back again and choose Places. We'll search for our home airport using its ICAO reference, KPDX, and then under Options, turn Default and Favorite on. Another feature of Log10 Pro is that time fields can be set to automatically update. Tap on More, then Settings, then Time Calculations, then Auto Fill Times. Because we've set our role to Student, Dual Received is already set to automatically update with the flight time. Once you're a rated pilot, you can turn Auto Enter off for Dual Received and on for PIC. For now, we'll keep Dual Received on and we'll also turn Night on. This is another great feature of Log10 Pro. If you use the recommended Out In Times for tracking your time, Night Time will be automatically calculated for you with pinpoint accuracy based on actual sunrise and sunset information. Now our logbook is set up for easy and efficient inputting of data. The Fly Now tab makes things even easier. When at the airport and getting set for takeoff, just tap Fly Now. Note that our aircraft and crew copy from our most recent flight. Also note that if you've set a certain aircraft up as your default, it will always fill here. Log10 Pro uses GPS technology to then input the departure airport automatically, Portland, and the out time is also set automatically based on the current time. Of course, we can change that manually if need be, just tap the field. When landed, we tap the blue location arrow in the To field, as well as the blue Time button to capture our in time, and then tap Done. There we go, flight logged in under 10 seconds. Of course, we can easily add any details on the flight by tapping the flight in the logbook. Here we can also add takeoffs, landings, remarks, and an image to the flight. And for those of you with ambitions to become a professional pilot, the remarks section is very important. Detailed remarks are an illustration of your dedication and passion for flying. Once you have the required hours for your check ride, if you're in the US, Log10 Pro makes it easy to fill in your IACRA application. Just tap on Reports, then Experience, then FAA IACRA Summary, tap Configure Report, choose All, and tap Generate. You can tap to save it as a PDF, and then share the report via airdrop, text, or email or share it online by tapping the share via my.log10.com button and following the instructions. Of course, if you're flying anywhere else in the world, there are many other summary reports that you'll find useful. In fact, Log10 Pro includes reports from many different countries. If we head back to the Reports tab, we can tap on the Change Region field, 
change to the country we want, and choose the report we want to export. One of the most important things you'll want to ensure is that your logbook is backed up. For this, you can use Log10 Pro's in-app manual backup. Just tap More, then Settings, then Backup, and then the plus button on the top right of the screen, and Log10 Pro will back up your logbook to your iCloud account. You can even export a backup for safekeeping elsewhere by dragging to the right, hitting Export, and then sending or saving the file. For the career pilot, it's now about getting hours of flying under your belt to build up for your instrument and commercial rating. Cross-country, instrument, and nighttime can all be easily tracked in Log10 Pro. It's worth mentioning that there are literally hundreds of fields you can choose from to track in Log10 Pro. Just tap any flight in the logbook, then the Actions button in the top right, then Configure Fields in the section you want to customize, then turn on the fields you want. And once you have those hours stacking up, you'll want to check out the Analyze tab by tapping Radar, then Analyze. Here you can see a quick summary of all your flight time. Tap on any of the groups to see a detailed breakdown of flight time and time by type. You can even see your flying on the world map. Just tap the map icon here. Your instructor is going to love how easy it is to add digital endorsements. Ready for your first solo? Tap More, Certificates, then the plus button in the top right to add a new endorsement. Tap the Action button, then Load Endorsement. Choose Solo Flight, first 90 day period. Your name is automatically filled in. Hit Apply. Then tap the Action button and share the endorsement with your instructor. They can open it in their Log10 Pro, fill in the aircraft and any other details, including the expiry date, tap Apply, tap the Actions button to add a signature, and they can send it back to you. Signed, sealed, and delivered. Voila! Not only do you get quick and easy logging of endorsements, Log10 Pro also helps you keep track of the ones that expire. Go back to the main radar view and tap Plan. That solo flight endorsement is now showing counting down the days, giving you advance notice of the time left to complete your solo flight requirements before the endorsement lapses. In fact, Log10 Pro tracks all your currency, certificates, ratings, medical, and more. Even duty and rest when you go pro. Phew! Well, we've covered the tip of the iceberg. Thanks for watching the first video in our Log10 Pro Supporting Your Aviation Career series. Next up is Log10 Pro for instructors. And of course, if you have any questions about Log10 Pro, please don't hesitate to contact our fantastic support team. Just tap more, then help, then contact support. Thanks for watching.